One of the reasons you should anti-fail your boat annually is a lot of people think, oh, it hasn't got much growth on it, but there's a whole lot more going on below the water that you don't understand about. We have um, sacrificial anodes. This boat's been in the water now for a year. If it was in the water much longer than this, there wouldn't be any of this sacrificial anode left. That's like a battery. One metal attacks the other. So we put a less noble metal on, being the zinc anodes. This will waste away instead of it attacking the stainless steel. So we brought this vessel up to have a look. Straight away I can see that the anodes here need replacing. The hardware's in good shape. Um, so we'll check thruster blades, make sure they're all intact. So we have a good look under the boat. Now we're starting to get some shell growth on, on areas. The hull's getting a heavy coating of slime on it. If you left this boat going much longer, you will see massive reductions in performance and an increase in fuel. So a lot of people think they're saving money by stretching out their anti-foul, but in, actually fact, in actual fact, they're spending money.